Hi, Coach Lisa from the Hub PT in High River, Alberta. And today we're doing movement prep number five. Uh, it lands in May this month and uh, let's get to it. So your first one is you're going to grab your travel roller, foam roller, whatever it may be, and you're going to lie down and roll. We're aiming for about five minutes. So this time you're actually gonna skip your time on a cardio machine and come on in grab a roller, they're just tucked in the back corner behind by your boots and shoes and everything, and uh, start rolling, five minutes. So what I teach when we first start rolling, grab it, start on the bum, sink in, enjoy it, okay? So quick demonstration, getting down onto the ground, sitting on there and then finding those spots, those niggling places, just move it back and forth. When you find a spot, you're gonna just sit into it, relax and rest, enjoy the moment, all right? Five minutes of that, go through legs, upper body, whatever you need. We're working on opening up some of our fascial tissue and everything else. Now we're going into a push-up, any way you like it. So tall push-up, working on shoulders and getting everything strong, five of these. Then we're going into a sideline T-spine opener. So what you're doing is you're making sure that your knees are stacked on top of each other when you're on your side. And you want to, your goal is to get that shoulder, the top shoulder all the way across to the other side without having those knees leave the ground. So I'll demonstrate, it's five per side. So on your ground, on your side, Stacking your arms, driving knee into knee into the ground. And then we're working on rotating through without these knees coming off the ground. And back. Five on each side. Follow with your eyes. So as your hand moves, follow your eyes all the way. So that's gonna allow the spine to rotate. And we're also being mindful of where we're tight, where we're uh, stronger, and which side is stronger as well, all right? Then we're going into a dowel donkey kick. So, you're gonna grab a dowel. They're tucked around, floating around everywhere. Best friend in a gym. Trying to balance that dowel across your low spine. So find the balance point. Connecting core to pelvis, and then using the glutes, so your butt muscles, to be able to get into that donkey kick. We do not want the dowel to fall. Five on each side. No, that's only three, but. So be mindful of what hips moving. All right, think about where your hips are articulating. Think about how everything's moving and if that dowel is balanced. That's what we're working on. So we're trying to train abdominal, um, or abdominal structure, a little bit of intra-abdominal pressure as well, and getting that pelvis to ribcage connection. So critical alignment. Lateral band walks, we know what they are. You're gonna put this around your thighs either below the knee or just above, never on the joint. I like having it below the knee on my calf muscles. Now we're going for a lateral walk. I'll show you on here. So we're reaching with the heel. All right, five in one direction, five in the other, zero degree in the hip. Now what we're doing is we're going for a 45 degree hip angle. So hips are forward, 45 degree angle, same movement, work on shoulder posture. Reaching with the heel first, five on each side, in each direction, okay? Core's engaged, practice that critical alignment, so rib cage to pelvis connection. And finally, a little bit of fun and challenge all at the same time, you're working on a ball slam and jump. So what we're trying to do is jump the same time that ball hits the ground. So take a little bit of practice, 
five each total. You have a whole month to practice it, so it's all good. So you're going to take that ball, slam it down, jump at the same time, okay? And there you go. Five of those. If you feel like you're not warm yet, then you're going to go into cardio bike, uh, curve treadmill, and get used to the warm up that way. All right, so movement prep number five from the Hub PT in High River. Uh, enjoy, and uh, we'll see you soon.